What is up, boys and girls? And I would like to welcome you to the world premiere of a Briar full gameplay. We have got the brand new champion going to be playing her in jungle, which is her main role. She is the unsatiable hunger or something like that. So basically, she is a mix between something like Warwick and Vex and a couple of other champions mixed in the fray. But uh, really quickly, in case you guys didn't watch my champion breakdown video, I'm going to explain to you guys what this champion does. So my passive is that I apply bleed from my attacks and abilities, and I do not have any innate health regen. So you know how normal champions could just stand here and like get a certain amount of health regen? Some champions have more, some champions have less. Briar has absolutely none. But I do do percentage... Um, I uh, heal Briar for 20%, 25% of the pre-mitigation damage. So basically, I have to go on the offensive to get any sort of health regen. My Q is a targeted um, leap and a stun. So it's pretty simple champion, or a pretty simple uh, ability. My W is I'm going to enter into a blood, blood frenzy, self-taunting to the nearest enemy champion for five seconds. So I'm literally going to CC myself. This is her main ability and the one that we're going to max first. And then my E is the only way to break myself out of the blood frenzy other than getting a kill. Um, and then my R is, yeah, look at look at the map, by, by the way. Look at the map. My R is certain death. I kick a dagger. I fly across the map like I'm a Dragon Ball Z character. And uh, yeah, so there, as you can see, I'm berserk. I cannot get myself off of this red buff. I am literally just, you have to kill the red buff. We'll go ahead and spite it for our first camp. Uh, we'll do Krug's down. Actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to path up. No idea what ideal pathing looks like. On this champion but yeah make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel because we're gonna be playing a lot more briar we're gonna be trying her out in all kinds of different roles with all kinds of different builds and then i don't think i ever explained my e so that's my e it is a long charge up ability that does a lot of damage if you knock them into a wall that's kind of the key um i was actually lucky enough to get a sneak peek access to briar i haven't played her this is my first time playing her but i did get a little bit of a sneak peek and i got to um talk to the devs Riot August, who designed the champion, designed one of my favorite champions, Senna. And he said, when the E knocks into a wall, it is it does so much damage. It is basically like a full AP Nunu uh, ult going off. So, yeah, that's that's the champion. We're going to be entering a bloodlust and just going on the offensive. This is definitely going to be one of the most 1v9 champions in the game. And, uh, yeah, let's see how she plays, guys. Uh, one thing I didn't mention is that... Uh, my Bloodlust Frenzy does give me a lot of bonus stats in addition to my ultimate, which also gives me stats and does a lot of damage, but I'm really, really excited about using the ultimate. I just think it's like such a cool idea to like be able to fly across the map. Oh, and then when I, I fly in, I fear everyone except for the target that I hit. So it's like I'm like singling them out and just, you know, going nuts, like chomping down, you know what I mean? So here we go, guys. Our very force uh, or uh, gank as Briar. So I think if I press W, I'm going to be like blood frenzying on him. Throw him into the wall. Oh, I, I need to charge that all the way up. Okay, so I'm literally not playing the game here right now, by the way. Oh my God, I can't break myself out of it. Oh my God, I can't break myself out of it. <laughs> that was a little terrifying. Not gonna lie. I forgot that my E is literally the only way to break myself out. So you kind of need to hold on to your E to break yourself out of the blood frenzy. Luckily, the enemy jungle got a little scared there and ran away. Uh, we're probably going to be going maybe Triforce. I don't really know what to build on this champion, guys. There seem it feels like there's a lot of different um, build paths. What happens if I just press W? Well, she just like dashes and doesn't get frenzied. Huh. So if there's no enemies around at all, she just doesn't get frenzied. Interesting. All right. So I really thought my E would throw him into the wall there, but I guess it didn't. I need to charge it up a little bit more. All right, here we go. We're coming in for the, the bot gank. Hopefully, we can get a kill here. Looking for the stun. Going into the blood frenzy. I'm not controlling my character. It's just going off on its own. <laughs> that is so goofy, man. <laughs> that is so goofy. So, I actually thought it was just like a permanent blood frenzy. But it appears that um, it's actually not. It only lasts for five seconds. I think, I think the Blood Frenzy uh, from my ultimate is actually just straight up, like, permanent. Oh, uh, that guy's level 5. Let's, let's not actually mess with him. Charge this up. Okay, so one thing is that it's a little awkward because once you choose the direction, you can't, like, swipe it around. It is, it is very difficult to land, I would say, her E is. 
Um, is she low? But yeah, you need to be very, very careful with your target selection with this champion and with just like who you choose to go in on. Cause like if I were, oh, stun, frenzied. Beautiful setup from my Galio. Dude, my team is honestly hooking me up so hard with these ganks. Love it, love it, love it. I'm going to be an absolute nightmare. Okay, so we're going to try to see if that hits. It stuns them against the wall for 1.5 seconds. And then apparently just like straight up one shots them once we get a little bit of stats. But yeah, we are going to be wanting to max my W. Just frenzy onto this. But then as you can see, I can break myself out of it. So she kind of like screams to like snap herself out of the frenzy. It's kind of cool. Oh, and I just noticed the champion has no mana. Nice. Nice champion, right? Hey yeah, guys, would love to know your guys' thoughts on this. Uh, the, the thematic of the champion is really, really cool. I like it a lot. Um, it definitely does feel a lot like Warwick where you're like, you choose a target and then you're just kind of like hunting them down, you know? Is it an AoE? Oh, it's an AoE. So built-in Kiana ult on her E. I I I'm just going to say it. This champion is going to be very, very, very broken when she first comes out. And I think that's just something that we're going to have to make our peace with. But there's also going to be like, <laughs> I think the Briar on your team is going to be a little bit of a, a feed machine sometimes. No, no pun intended. Like this champion is very much like 1v9 or solo lose the game. Got him coming in. Coming in, coming in. You know what? Let's uh let's feed on this kid. Nice. That targeted stun on the Q is kind of nice, not gonna lie. But yeah, I really, really like her. I like her personality. Let's take let's take a look at her um at her recall here. I really like how they went for like a fun, loving, like goofy personality when they could have very easily made this like a super edgy, like, you, you know, the type, like brooding, like, I don't want to say emo. It's kind of like a lame term to use, but like, yeah, a little bit emo, like, oh, woe is me. I can't control my hunger. I'm one with the darkness, like that type of stuff. When really she's like, she, I, I'm, I'm very much, uh, She's very charismatic, is what I'm trying to say. Alright, let's throw all these guys into the wall. Berserk herself against the big one. And then I'm unberserked once the, the target dies. So I'm really excited to try out this certain death. I think this is going to be so freaking funny. I'm hoping I land it. It might be a little bit hard to land, but dude, that, that global range is just so broken, man. Berserk myself. I think it's really cool how they um kind of put in like a almost like a like a tuning lever. Like like CCing yourself is a very big deal. It's something that no champion has done in this game. But like with champions like Rel and a couple others, like there are like built-in like downsides to the champions. And I, I think that's really neat that they put in one like this. Okay, 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 okay. So I don't know. Enemy double kill. I hope this lands. I hope this lands. Oh God! Oh! Okay, so I was really hoping that would go onto Ash, but at least we got the one kill. It's not too bad. <laughs> so you just fly across the map. You fear everyone around you except for your target, and then you it. it like that, there's a reason the ability is called certain death. Riot August explained it to me like this. One of you is almost certainly going to die. And enters an empowered blood frenzy and will pursue her prey until death. During this time, she gains 23 armor and magic assist. So she does actually get um does actually get tank here. Oh no, 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 no. Please, please, please hit her. Uh, yeah, I think I, yeah, I think I'm just gonna walk out of this one, guys. I think I'm just gonna opt out of this fight real fast. Oh dear God. Okay, thank you, Kha'Zix. Wait, do I die if I kill? Do I die if I hit this? We actually got like a lot of um, a lot a lot of a life steal, but it's definitely a champion where you just like constantly have to be on the offensive, which is really cool. 
Alright, let's see how she does with doing Rift Herald. Boom. Dude, that scream is really, really uh, satisfying to land. Yeah, as I mentioned, you absolutely want to... Uh, I'm not going to do Rift Herald. That's, that's, uh, that's boarded. You absolutely want to max your W. Um, Wing you yourself and then not having it max out is probably just like the fastest way ever to, to grief. Zerg, baby. Oh, it's got like a cleave to it. Is that... Huh. Alright, so a little bit of action going on over there. I want I want to come join this. I'm just not familiar with how my like how fast my certain death flies. So like if this was a Vexal, I would be landing this. An enemy has been slain. An ally has been slain. An oh, I hit it. Oh god, wish me luck. Oh no, man, it's so close to hitting the um hitting the wall there. I need to get out of here. Uh, if I jump in, I'm definitely dying. Nature's more out of control. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. So you need to kind of find targets. Oh my God, my Yumi. Yumi is such a beast. My Yumi is such a beast. You will be remembered. You're a beast. Love you. Guys, give some love to this Yumi down in the comments because I was literally just like not paying attention at all. And they saved me. Dude, I am so, so low health. Like, I want to help you here, but ah, we're going to try it. We're going to try it. No, 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 we're not. No, we're not. Yeah, we're going back. Uh, we will go... We'll probably go Merc Treads this game. I would say they've got... Quite a bit of CC. Alright, now let's try to go do... Try to go do Rift Herald. So, full runes, guys. Uh, I think Fleet Footwork and Conquer are both going to be good pages, just depending on matchups. Uh, their team is a little on the tankier side, on their top side, jungle and top. We got Conquer, Triumph, Alacrity, Coup de Grasse, Sun Impact, Ultimate Hunter, and then Attack Speed, AD Armor. Kha'Zix got him off of... Rift Herald... Oh god, it went on Garen. Oh god. Dude, it's literally just it's literally just Oh. Okay. Now I berserk on her. Wait, I'm fast. Oh god, she's going to drag me into the turret. Oh god. Stop, stop. Wait, this is too funny actually. I mean, that that she she just doesn't know my damage output actually. That's okay, because I don't either. How how long do I have to charge that up to get it, like, to actually knock back? Get a plate or two up here. By the way, we were personally challenged by the creator of the cha champion, Riot August, to make Briar work as a support. So let me know down in the comments if that's something you guys want to see. All right, it is very weird to just be sitting here at like an exact number of health and it just like not go up. Let's see if we can do this. But like we get we get health regen. For, we we have so much life steal, but you just have to hit him. You just have to constantly go on the offensive. Zerk this. Oh, this this champion's gonna be like such an int machine, man. Like with that with that berserk. I can just see it now. Has been My jungler locks in Briar and then runs it down bot lane. Alright, max in that W. Should be should be getting pretty pretty scary when we press W. Might be in here. Oh, looks like he's gone. Let's just uh catch this wave. Zerk. It's kind of nice that it's just like an autopilot champion almost. And we missed the cannon. Unlucky. 
Uh, we're gonna drop this mid and then go into dragon. I do have 2,000 gold, but I kind of like the fact that my Yumi's on top of me right now, so. I'm pretty, I'm sure, I'm sure they're on dragon by now, right? Oh, they're not. Dude, my dra my ultimate's only an 80 second cooldown. That's actually insane. Um, this is definitely going to be a champion that like you have to know your limits. You know what I mean? But I want to limit test because you'll never know your limits if you don't test them. Uh, we, we, we can just do dragon and then pull them out. We pull them away from their turrets. Uh, turrets are very scary for this champion. Oh man, I want to, I want to ult this. I, I, I ulted, I ulted. Oh, freaking field goal, man. I'm just doing the jungle now, or dragon now. I feel kind of bad because now I'm leaving my Galio, but... Do a lot of dam damage to Dragon? Not really. Man, if that ulti landed, that's actually just like such a free kill. Dirk. Hit him with that. Ooh, nice. Is he gonna live? Uh, yeah. Turrets, man. Turrets are too scary. Oh, here I am. Here I am. Dude, see, if I have my ulti here, it's like actually just a triple kill. Oh, we might go for it. Oh, no. I switched targets. Oh, God. Uh, uh. Oh. What? Yo, that 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 guy that was interesting. All right, my clear speed's actually getting like really really high. I literally have almost 3000 gold, but like I oh my god, bro. It's it's so tempting to just run it down. Oh, Emilio. Okay, that was awesome though. That was actually awesome. I didn't realize you could use your Q during your bloodlust as well. That was really sick. He tried to live. He ulted himself. All right, we go back now. We go back. Gotta go back. I, I feel like I'm going to spike so freaking hard on two items. I'm not quite there yet, but I'm very close. All right, Yumi. Me and you, bro. Let's go. So we got that dash and then we have a targeted dash. Dude, I really like her animations, bro. Like that little somersault that she just did from her W. She didn't do that time, but. All right, we're going to get a red buff. Boom, boom, boom. I will smite it. Get some more candies for my, ju my jungle pet. Um... Going pretty deeps. 10 seconds on my ulti. Dude, the stun range is actually like not that high. Kinda, I kind of want to send it. I kind of want to. Should I send it? Oh god, it's on Milio again. Okay, let's go. Nobody kill me. Nobody kill me. Wait, that is so freaking fun. That is so fun, man. All right, let's go heal up off the bot lane. It is really nice to have a Yumi healing me. Oh wait, how am I healing? I should I shouldn't be healing right now. Wait, how am I healing? I, I, hey, I think, I, I don't know, I don't know what's going on with that one. You're not, you're not supposed to heal at all. Guys, let me know down in the comments if you know why I was healing there. It couldn't have been Moonstone. Hmm, yeah, I really don't know. I have no idea. Stun, Frenzy. Slam him into the wall. No, bro. So close. 
I want I want to see that big explosion, man. 410 magic damage. Eh, it's really not. Eh, I mean, it's a, it's a decent amount. I think Riot August might have been exaggerating a little bit when he said it was like a full AP new new ult. I oh well, I I guess it's uh 168 plus 320. All right, now let's start let's let's start feasting, guys. Let's start finding this Lilia. Just completely choking her out. Same with the Garen. We, we we want some uh we want some victims. Got her. Oh my god, no way, man. Dude, thank god it didn't hit anybody down there. Actually, I kinda wanna see it hit someone down there. I I wanna do like a cross map ulti. Mm. Mm. And I'm stunned. Ooh! I'm sorry, Yumi. I failed you. Alright, at some point, I probably should have hit my E and, like, knocked myself out of that. It's just kind of weird because you're, like, you, once again, you're CCing yourself when you when you do your chilling scream. It's not like it's, like, an instant thing. That's fine. We're probably going to drop a dragon here, and we just got aced, but you know what? It's okay. This champion's really fun, by the way. Like, I, I'm liking what I'm seeing. I think jungler players especially are going to really enjoy this champion. Big taunt from Galio. Can he steal it? Nice try, nice try. Alright, well now I'm just going to start, like, fishing with my R. And, uh, see, see how it works out. Because, like, this thing goes super, super far. So I'm going to wait to see if someone gets this mid wave. Don't push mid. I'm going to ult. Oh my god, I hit it! Here we go! <laughs> oh my god! No freaking way! It goes so fast, it's like the camera can't even keep up with it. No way, man. Like, imagine dive-bombing like that into, like, the middle of their team. Oh! Okay. Okay. Where you, where, hey, where, what's your what's your, what's your next plan, bro? Stun. Uh, I'm getting kited around too hard. Lily, Lily is hard to. Uh, berserk. Stun, maybe. Oh, yo, my autos do so much damage. Ow! Oh! All right, bad flash, bad flash. Uh, we got we got Sterics now. Yeah, once he flashed on us, I think we just, like, accept our death. Dude, 13, 3, and 4, not bad. Not bad at all for our first time playing the champ. Very, very fun, too. Alright, now let's start uh, thinking about farming up our jungle into Baron. Dude, the global alt is, like, way, way too fun. Okay, it's, it's not technically global. It's about half the alt. It's about half the map from for its radius. So if as you can see, if, if I'm from the fountain, it's not like I can like shoot it into their fountain. That would be kind of not ideal. But if you're it, if you're here and you shoot it, you're going into the fountain. You cannot knock yourself out of that one. All right, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna think about where Lilia is gonna be. Is she gonna be on her Raptors? I I I want to find her. I want to find her and I want to do another global. I think she's on Raptors, but like I'm not confident enough to like shoot it there. Where's my, where's my Yumi? Get on me, little kitty. They're not on this, are they? Oh my god, they are. I ulted, I ulted, I ulted. Oh my god, go, 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 go. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh. I don't, I don't, I don't have smite. I don't have smite. I use my smite, unfortunately. Dang, I shouldn't have used my smite. Unlucky, bro. I literally, I'm gonna be real with you guys. I was kind of panic pushing buttons at that point. The fact that the ult landed, like my heart was like freaking pumping. It is, dude. There's gonna be so many crazy moments with this um 
with this champion. And I think maybe I should be maxing my E second. I'm not really sure. Can I go over walls? Oh, I can. Nice. That's kind of sick. Boom, boom, boom. Your team has destroyed an inhibitor. Alright. Time to do some more globals. I'll hit someone. Oh, it's poor Milio! Poor Milio! <laughs> no, so close, dude. If I could get one auto on Ash, I, I think I might have actually lived. I would have gotten triumph, I would have gotten my um my healing. Bro, the ultimate is the funniest ability in the freaking game. I'm getting used to how fast it goes now. I'm getting a little more confident with it. Uh, We'll probably go Death Dance here. Oh, Death Dance is going to be like a top tier item for this champion for sure. Now, obviously, one, I'm not a jungle player primarily. Although I am doing a jungle climb starting today, ironically. Uh... There's definitely like a lot of efficiencies I could be doing in terms of like clear. So, you know, maybe maybe check out someone else's video for that. Like I am extremely fed and I, I'm like in a position to 1v9. But like, you know, my clears haven't been the most optimal thing ever. We'll work on it, guys. We will definitely work on it. Mostly I've just been looking for kills, to be honest. But that's what this champion's all about. It's just all, you know, finding the... Find, finding the kill angle. I just gave Yumi red buff. <laughs> Alright. Ah, I thought they were going up. Okay. I don't have my ulti, so... Can't really team fight super well. Guess I'll just get the dragon. Dude. That's a lot of damage, actually. Yeah, the Berserk is um kind of nuts. Alright, Garen's pushing top. Dude, if I had my ulti here, this would be so sick. Berserk. I love that they like design a champion that's like you can't even be mad. When your jungler feeds with it, because it's like, you know, Briar was just hungry, bro. I can't jump this? You're kidding. I can with W, but not with Q. An enemy has been nice, nice. Alright. I'm sending it. Oh, man! Hit him with the stun. Okay, yeah, the fact that I didn't realize you could stun while you're bloodlusted. Yeah, that's um that that kinda that kinda makes it a lot better. Oh god, stop! I love bro. I love that I'm like begging my champion to stop inting. Immaculate. All right, we got an inhib. I have death stance now. I think I'll just recall for that. Unless. Nah, I I, I want to fight. I want to fight. I should not want to fight. I should not have wanted to fight. We're getting out of here, Yumi. Maybe if I had my ult. Maybe if I had my ulti. Five seconds. Eh. I'm down. I'm down. God. It's that ah, okay, that's hard to land. I'm chasing her. We're going. Alright. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get back here. Oh my god. So goofy. Uh. Oh, I'm super dead, aren't I? Man, I mean, I survived for a long time, honestly. 
A surprisingly long time, but uh, yeah, not not quite not quite there yet. All right, we got two dragons. Let's play for let's play for Baron. Let's actually get it this time. The enemy's inhibitor is respawning soon. Dude, Tit I feel like Titanic Hydra, maybe even Ravenous Hydra would be really good on this Your guy. Has Sorry, this hurt. woman. Dude, that's another thing is I'm very happy that it's not like a little kid. She definitely looks like a kid in her splash art. And I think a lot of people were not only being really weird about that, but like super disappointed about it. But she is uh, from the mouths of Riot themselves. She's supposed to be the age of like a young woman, like someone who just like graduated college. I think they said, I think they said like age 22 or 23. All right, all right. You guys want to see? You guys want to see the ultimate int machine? I'm going in. Damn it, man! Imagine if that landed though, bro. Just imagine. Oh, that is very hard to, uh, that is extremely hard to land, by the way. She's so fast, man. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. <laughs> all right. All right. We're going on a rocket ship. We're going on a rocket ship. How are you as fast as me? I'm, I got I got the hunger. I'm hungry. I'm sending it straight down bot lane. Pray for us. You me say your prayers. I re I literally just like want to send it. Oh 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 oh. Please 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 please. Yes! Oh my god! Here we go! <laughs> you <were slain> <laughs> oh my god! Guys, do you do you think uh do you think Ash is happy about that one? She's just minding her own bus aw. She's just minding her own business. All of a sudden she gets hit in the back by a dagger and just gets one shot. Can her Q go over walls or not? I can't, I can't quite figure that out. My teeth are um, all right. My Kha'Zix top's doing dragon. I should probably be focusing on objectives. I'm just having way too much fun, like literally just sending it down mid though, man. I think I'm going to do it again. I, I think I'm just going to go on a rocket ship again, guys. Oh, actually? Got the objective. I don't think I can go in on that, man. I think Garen's a little, little too tanky for me. Neat. Mm. Dude, like Briar definitely seems like someone who, other than her ultimate, which seems very much like team fight based. It doesn't really feel like I have a lot of options to like actually team fight. Like if I jump in there, I'm gonna die like literally just instantly. Shut down. There it is. Finally. Finally, man. Um. Uh yeah, we can do Baron. I I bet with my bloodlust and with my W on, like we actually do Baron really, really fast. Can solo? Uh, yeah. Let me solo with Yumi. Let's see, let's see. Guess it's not really a solo if I have a Yumi, but yeah, definitely. I definitely have the sustain. Well, until it comes down. Where's she going? Where's she going? Where's she going? Where's she going? Oh, baby. No! <laughs> Wait! 
Okay, now we're berserk. Get back here. Berserk? Oh no. Wait. Dude, look at my health bar. Like I know I I know I have a wait. Oh, he's just giving it. He's just giving it. I respect it, bro, but I'm I'm a viewer. I don't think you had a choice. We got the penta. It was slightly it was slightly gifted to us, but I'm pretty sure we had him no matter what. 26 kills and a penta kill. This champion is really, really disgusting. Like insanely disgusting. You know what? I'm I'm taking my Yumi into the fountain. I don't care. We're gonna try to time it. So that it hits when Milio spawns. <laughs> Wait! We <laughs> oh my god, it's too freaking funny, man. Oh, good god. I am having more fun in the jungle with this champion than I have ever had. Dude. The- oh my god. The ulti is just like Vex ult on a million different steroids. All right, we're, we're, we're full build. So we need to elixir up. And then, dude, I'm just going to keep shooting my ult. Like, there, like nothing. There are going to be so many games that you throw playing this champion because you just feel like throwing your ultimate down down mid. Like, I, like they actually might have created the most fun ultimate in the game. I like to be alive, I swear. Dude, that is just way too much fun. Okay, so my ultimate lands and deals 800 physical damage to everything. Okay, so it's AOE too. It's not even just like... Dang, that's... That's brutal. Because that means, like, if your teammate gets hit, you're probably getting one shot just from this alone. Because it's a it's a 1.5 seconds AOE fear. Dude, August, what have you done, man? What, like, what has this guy done? Again, all right, I'll go back for my Yumi. Guys, get, seriously, give me, give me some love for the Yumi down in the comments. This this guy has been my my warrior buddy. Oh. Oh, there it was, there it was. So yeah, again, really just not as much damage as I thought it would be. Uh, 1,100 damage. That's actually a lot late game. That that, that actually is a lot. All right, I want to sh I want to shoot my all at her. Oh, should land? Yes. Dude, you just become a freaking rocket ship. Oh, I didn't even touch him there. Eh, whatever. Let's dive. Eh, let's dive. All right, there it is, guys. 28 kills on my very first game of Briar. This is definitely a super fun one. Um, I love this champion a lot, and I think that everyone is going to love them. Huge shout out to the Yumi and everyone else that played. Um, everyone else that played the game. Uh, yeah, shout out to my community for hopping in this game. She is currently on the PVE, but she will be out in the next two weeks. We did 55,000 damage. Uh, we're going to keep working on our Briar jungle and our jungle in general. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think about Briar. Take it easy. Peace. Uh...